this is our wind tunnel. Here we can produce different temperatures, sunlight, rain, snow. We can uh, produce cold weather up to minus 30 degrees and uh, heat up to plus 50 degrees. Uh, the car is running on a front wheel dyno. For running tests we can drive it up to 200 km per hour. We can also produce air speed up to 200 km per hour. And the wind is of course coming from the front of the car. It's going around in a circle. So we have a big fan in the rear. And we have a heat exchanger so that produces the heat and cold in front of the car. So we can go around here and look at the fan. These are called turning vanes, it's to get the air to move in the right direction. In here you can see the fan, it's three meters in diameter. This is a simulation in 55 kilometers per hour. Okay, now we're running a AC test. It's a cooling capacity in the car. Uh, the solar is now simulating a desert sun. Okay, now we're running a rain simulation test for the engine filter so that the engine is capable of handling, uh, driving it through heavy rain. The advantage with the climate wind tunnel is that you can reproduce the same climate each test. So if you have two components and want to compare them, you can uh, be sure that you have the same wind, the same temperature, the same solar, or the rain or snow. Thank you.